What's up, Nemo here. I wanted to make a quick video. It's surrounding the, what is it, the Face ID fail. Here is iPhone 10. Now, unlocking it is as easy as looking at it and swiping up. And, you know, let's try that again. Ho, ho, ho. Let's uh, go to backup here and get right in. It is, it's blowing up on the internet right now, saying that during the keynote, he took his phone and he was going to show an example of how Face ID worked and it failed. Well, I'm gonna stop you right there. So as you see on the screen, it is showing this right here, the passcode login. That's what's displaying on, on the big screen while he was trying to use this. That doesn't mean that it failed, it just means that the phone was locked. He didn't want to type in a passcode right in front of everybody at the keynote. So see how Touch ID works right now. See, it unlocked my phone. I'm going to restart my phone now, show you what happens. So I'm sliding it off. I just turned off my phone. All right, my iPhone's coming back on. And you will see the same screen during his keynote. As you can see, and it reads, Touch ID requires your passcode with iPhone restarts. So that's exactly what... Am I in focus here? Now watch, I'm going to try to do my Touch ID with this iPhone. It won't work because I just restarted it. And that's what happened in front of millions of people at the keynote. Now, if I type in my code, it works. I doubt he wanted to spend time doing that during the keynote. It was not a fail. All right, let's get that over with. No fail. It's good. But I will say that $1,000 is a lot to pay. All right. Just had to get that off my chest. All right, good, bye.